a bartender with an unfulfilled dream of becoming an astronaut. Despite her passion for science and encouragement from her mother, Rex faced setbacks, including her mother's passing and the need to care for her father, causing her to defer her education and pursue a different career path. Years later, inspired by a high school reunion and a chance encounter with a former classmate who had ventured into space tourism, Rex decides to pursue her dream and applies to NASA's astronaut training program. With the help of her best friend Nadine, who embellishes her resume to make her appear more qualified, Rex manages to impress the selection committee and secure a spot in the program. At the training facility, Rex struggles initially but forms a friendship with Violet Marie Wislawski, a brilliant physicist who helps her grasp the complex theories. However, Rex's secret is eventually discovered, leading to her expulsion from the program. Determined to prove herself, Rex proposes a daring plan to rescue a group of astronauts stranded in space, which ultimately leads to her redemption and a chance to fulfill her dream of becoming an astronaut. From the opening scene all the way to the closing credits, Rex provided the narration for Space Cadet. She commented on the story's happenings while providing background information on herself and others around her on a frequent basis. Space Cadet, which just managed to stay under two hours, benefited from Rex's narration, which advanced the plot and addressed any possible plot holes. But until the very end of the film, no one knew to whom Rex was narrating Space Cadet. There were a lot of possible explanations for who Rex seemed to be speaking to, but it seemed like he was addressing the audience. Early on in Space Cadet, it was revealed that Rex had promised her mother that she would continue communicating with her after her death. But that wasn't the point of having narration in Space Cadet. The title sequence and the ending both featured animated journal entries that explained Rex's background. According to the last scene of Space Cadet, Rex's narrations were actually entries from her journal. It was a smart way to close the film and tie everything together, and that's why they weren't addressed to anyone in particular. Space Cadet was able to wrap up the story by focusing on Rex's and others' growth through the use of the diary entry framing technique. A crescent moon in Florida piqued Rex's interest at the start of Space Cadet. She quit her job as a bartender early to go dance under it with her pals since she was so enamored with it. It means good luck Rex, informed her boss. Rex reconnected with space tourism entrepreneur Todrick Spencer at a less than stellar high school reunion and told him that Spencer had been an influence on him while he was in college. Rex drew motivation from their discussion and decided to pursue her goal of being an astronaut again, despite the fact that she lacked the prerequisite skills. Just when Rex thought he had no more will to live, she glanced out her window and pointed to the crescent moon. She spoke to the moon and said, I see you, girl symbolizing the widely held idea in astrology and spirituality that the moon is more feminine than the sun. Space Cadet has the makings of a women's empowerment film, what with its female protagonist who defies expectations and societal norms to achieve her goals and the empowering female choruses that fill the soundtrack. The crescent moon served as a symbol of Rex's strength as a woman, which contributed to her inspiration. It may have also brought back memories of her mother, the woman who had the greatest faith in her. Perhaps Rex's unique relationship to the crescent moon is related to its religious significance as a symbol of conception, life and death. To some extent, what it seems to be a corny, unrealistic romantic comedy, but it's more than that because of the message of self-confidence and the women's empowerment thread. The sincere portrayal of the stereotyped party girl by Roberts was the driving force behind Space Cadet's success. Those serene moments when Rex thought on her goals and journey were the most moving parts of the film. The premise of Space Cadet isn't to have an outlandish space story. The question of whether her account is plausible, which it isn't, is significantly less relevant than how Rex reached space. Her story is designed to be inspirational despite its implausibility. Even though Rex had no business being in space, that didn't take away from her rightful place there, even when they don't appear realistic that was the moral of Rex's story. Rex had all the makings of a successful adult when she rejected a college offer and her mother passed away. Despite the 10 years it took, Space Cadet proved that the only thing you really need is unwavering belief in yourself and your dreams to achieve them, regardless of how difficult they may be.